Hello everybody, welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. And in this video, I want to take a look back, all the way back, back to here, three weeks ago. I did a video on five coins to watch in March. We are coming towards the end of March now. And I thought this would be good to sort of like recap sort of what I said, look at the coins that I mentioned and just basically find out if they would have been sort of good investments or bad investments or, you know, and just see what kind of gains could or, or may not have been made. If this sounds interesting to you, please drop that like. Give me a subscribe if you're new watching and I'm going to dive into this. But before I do so, I need to let you know, I am not a financial advisor. These are just my own personal opinions on the market. So please always do your own research before investing any money. That being said, just taking a quick look at the market, looking healthy. <laughs> People always go to me, where'd you get this energy? Listen, I don't know where it comes from. I, I go to sleep, I wake up and I just, I think about happy things and then I wake up happy. <laughs> <laughs> what am I laughing for? Anyway, let's do this. Because every month I like to do five coins you must watch. Not buy, watch. I mean, if you want to buy them, you can. I mean, and essentially that's what, you know, I just want to put it on your radar. Because you just don't know what they are going to do. And you best believe April's coming soon and I will be doing five coins to watch in April. Let's just take a look at this though. Because what were the coins that I was talking about? The very first coin that I was I was talking about was Certic. Now I'm just gonna, you know, be super realistic. Some coins may have gone up, some coins may have gone down. I'm just gonna keep it real. And I wanna find out what kind of gains could we have made if we invested into them. And again, uh, this is why I say five coins to watch. <laughs> because you don't want to just jump in when someone says something. You need to do your research. That's why if I say watch, you can do your research. You can look into it and you can say, oh, yeah, that sounds nice. Or you can say, actually, no, no, I'm better staying away from that. The first coin I said was Certic. Uh, I, if you want to know exactly why I said this, you can click on the video and check it out yourself. It, I, I break it down as to why I think you should be watching it. Uh, but, you know, I'm just going to focus on the price. It was £1.22 back then. What is it now? It's sitting on £1.96. Now, look, here's what we can do. We can take the price of what it is today, £1.96, uh, 97. Oh, you know, but that, that penny counts because you can get 1p bubblegums, but today I'm, I'm investing, so putting that in Certic. Divide it by what was the price in the video, £1.22. It should give us like a rough percentage or times actually it'd be, it's not percentage it's a gain it's an x gain it should tell us how much money you would have made i'm laughing because it's not that much difference in this and this particular one divide it by uh but still one pack been super realistic you would have made now in this case <laughs> you have to just ignore the one because you can't say one times your money <laughs> because it's the same but you would have made 0 0.06 percent uh, on no point zero, yeah, point zero six percent gain had you invested into Certic at that time. I'm gonna grab up, <laughs> grab, grab, not grab, grab. I'm gonna grab up a sticky note, <laughs> and I'm just gonna put this in because I just want to see. So number one would have been uh, zero point six percent, yeah, because it's not even like one times your money. It's like <laughs> zero point six times your money, and I'm gonna do this for all five coins just to see how much percentage we would uh, percentage how much x gains we would have made because i can't figure out the percentage right now it's a bit of a mad one look this is 1.24 percent but that <laughs> that's based on what it was back then it's just mad to anyway you know what i mean let's look at the next coin so i'm gonna take this video and shimmy it across the next coin would have been harmony harmony okay i didn't sound let me, let me try again Harmony. I need to sound a bit nice when I say, you know, otherwise you just think, oh, it sounds like, hold on. <coughs> Harmony. Yeah, that sounded all right. I can deal with that one. <laughs> I'm not cutting nothing. It was sitting on two pence. My God. Three weeks ago. Three weeks. <laughs> 14 pence today. Mad. Because it's come down 10%, which means it was even higher than that. What did it go up to? That's much. I'm going to check this with you right now. Trust me. Let's do it over the last seven days. Let's have a quick look. The highest it was, 16 pence. What was I doing? Wasn't even watching. It's fine anyway, because I'm holding it long term, you know. <laughs> I believe this is going to go to one, two, three, five, ten pounds. So it's fine. But it hit 16 pence. That's mad. To be fair, 
I should have done that with Certic because I'm basing it on the price we see today. How high did Certic? Oh, okay. <laughs> it's similar. It's not that much different. Two pounds. Yeah, yeah, you would have made, what was it? Two, double your money. No. Mm, ish. Maybe 0.8 times your money. Anyway, let's just focus on this. Uh, I don't know. What do you think? Do you think I should do it from the price that it's been at? Maybe I should be saying its highest price over those three weeks because essentially people would want to be buying it and selling it if they did. Because I said watch. But if they did, selling it at the highest price. The highest price Harmony went was 16 pence. Ross! That's mad! In three weeks! <laughs> what am I laughing for? Bit of silence there. <laughs> Raw, that's mad. Anyway, let me put this in. That is mad. Actually, where's the calculator? So, 16 pence. Where? <sighs> you can't find any... Anyway... It's just, it's going around in my head. Circles and circles is mad. 0.14. And I'm going to add the 2, 3. Because them, them bits count. What is that? A piece of penny. I don't care what it is. Divide it by, what was it in here? Uh, 0.021 cents. Pence. <laughs> Pence. I'm going to show you all this uh, stuff in dollars at the end. Meaning the price gains, right? Because right now it doesn't matter. I just want to show you in price what you want to made. All right? So divide this by uh, 0.021. You would have made 6.7 times your profit had you had you invested in Harmony back then. Again, just coins to watch, you know, because you, you just don't know. Ugh, that's mad. Six, ugh, anyway, number two. Two was, uh, I should do a dash or something so I know, because this one here just looks like 1.06. It <laughs> looks like an update or something. Here we go. Uh, 6.77 times your money. I should put an X as well, so I know what I'm talking about. X. There you go. Right, so number three is coming. The next coin. Oh, I've got some burp action going on. That I said we should be paying, uh, maybe watching or paying attention to, or having a radar, whatever you want to call it, was, again, you can check this video, listen to understand why I said these coins. The next coin was Reef. Reef was sitting at 0, 2, 2 pence at the time. What is Reef sitting on now? Three point two. So what is that? A one percent gain? I don't know. It's hard to do percentages when you do these little numbers. Uh, but oh, it's not hard if you work at the calculator. But I just want to talk about the X gains, right? So let's do this. It's at three zero point zero three two pence right now. Zero point zero three two pence right now. Let's divide that by. Actually, should I get the full number? I'll get the full number. Point, uh, not that it's going to make a massive dif uh, difference. 0 0.03249. Divide it by. Now, where's Reef again in this video? It was 0 0.02275. Yeah? Uh, divide it by 0 0.02275. Because you've got to put the 2. two, two. <laughs> okay, talking too much. You would have made 1.42% gains. Well, what is that? Is that is that? Can you also say it's about point four? I don't know. I don't know why. It's weird because you can't say you made one times your money because one times one is one, <laughs> and ten times one is one. So even if you made a penny, you didn't because you still what? Anyway, I know what I mean. I'm gonna treat that as point four two because you. Okay, I'll just do one point four two. You know what? I'm gonna be super real. Uh, the last one said one point <laughs> one point six, so I'm just gonna put the one. I'm just going to do what it shows me. 1.6 times the gain. And this one was... Uh, you know what I mean, though, innit? Uh, 1.42 times the gain. Yeah? Okay. Well, that's what you would have made if you did invest at that time. Uh, let's take a, a look at the next coin. We're looking at Cardano. Sitting at 88 pence now. And in the video... I done it the wrong way around, didn't I? Oh, well. Uh, it's sitting on 88 pence now. So technically speaking, you wouldn't, you probably would just be breaking even now had you invested back then. And yeah, so to be fair, I'm just going to just call that zero <laughs> because you, you're breaking even. You're, you're not up. You're not massively down. Maybe you're down a couple of pennies, you know, uh, but you're not massively down uh, or massively up. Shall I say you might be up? Was it 8836 in the video? Uh, let's just see. I don't care if you're up. 88. Four, three. Okay, so you're <laughs> you're up a bit. So you know, I'm happy with that. At least you made like a few pennies on the side. 
um, if you have millions, then you're up like thousands. <laughs> because those little pennies, those little differences, these little things here that counts, that moves up a, uh, up a notch. You're making like a quick thousand pounds if you have 10 million of these coins. I don't, I mean, just some people might. Let's just go to the sticky note and just put four and just keep it. I'm just going to call it zero. Uh, just zero. Because you're not up and you're not down, you're just in the middle. Right, last coin I spoke about mm, to watch, right? And it was Goose. Goose Finance. Now, here's the thing. <laughs> here's the thing for me of Goose, right? Here we go. That's what I look at. £39. Goose has had a bit of a, uh, a wild uh, trip through its journey. It's, it's a brand new DeFi coin. And any like any new coin, new coins always tend to find their spot and space in the market. They were trying something in which my eyes, uh, you know, they need to improve it a bit more before they can blossom and bloom that's all i'm gonna say uh, but let's have a look at what price goose is today you were looking at 10 pounds 98 pence so essentially this one again that's why i said five kinds to watch <laughs> if you invested in this what would you be down let's just see it let's just have a quick look. look i'm gonna keep it real I have to keep it real because this is what we're about i don't care people love to make money but at the same time you need to accept that that you know this this crypto industry you could make or lose money and at the moment you only lose if you sell. And if you don't sell, you don't lose. And if you do sell, try sell at a profit. The good thing with Goose Finance is that, for me anyway, you know, I was, well, this is the thing. This is why it's a, a tough one to uh, to call because a lot of people that got into Goose Finance probably wouldn't just be holding on the price of this. They were f uh, staking it and farming it. So they probably made income, because well, I did, regardless of, the, of what the price Goose was here. Let me just do it. I was making a, a, a good income, a passive income, monthly, weekly, whatever it is, daily, through the, the staking in the nests and stuff. So it's what I, just watch the channel. Watch the video and you'll understand because there's so much you can do on Goose Finance and how to make money. But if you were someone that just bought the coin and you didn't stake and you wasn't, you know, going into the layered farming to make more interest every day, then yeah, you would be down. Let's just check this now. I'm going to be super real. £39.04 because uh, there's 4p counts right now, especially when you, you know, if you might be down if you invested into it at that time. Uh, what's the price that it was now? Uh, here we go. £10.98. I'm going to take this copy it divide it by because we want to see how much divide it by uh 10 pound 98 you would be down 3.5 times your money <laughs> which i shouldn't laugh really but you know but i've got to keep it real you know got to keep it actually no again that was just based off if you were just holding the coin because as far as i'm aware everybody that's got into goose they wasn't just holding the coin. They were staking it. And they were using them coins to make an income. We're going to put minus 3.5. And this is why you should always do your research on these coins, especially, especially DeFi ones. I think, you know what? You, you know what? You want my truth opinion right now? <laughs> this has just gone up 17%. Mad. Crazy. Ludicrous. Boom. In one day. This looks like a great buying opportunity for me. Because... And the only reason I'm sent on this one, because all the other ones have been sort of stable, higher or whatever, this one's been lower. And when I look at this lower, I look at this as a buying opportunity. And, you know, again, not investment advice, but I've seen it go as high as the 39s and the 40s. Because if it went back to there, that's three times your money. That's all I'm saying. I've seen it go as high as £90. Just saying. Anyway, let's just uh, evaluate the entire situation here. I've kept it super real, and I think I need to keep it super real, not beat around the bush. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to work this out here and then and work out what kind of times uh, X gains you would have actually have made had you invested into these coins. OK, so we're going to go 1.6, 1.6 times 6.77 times 1.42. I don't know how I'm going to do the lot. Actually, no, 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 not times. One more time than it for It's add <laughs> times. Jesus Christ. One, why didn't you tell me? 0.6. <laughs> I can imagine people going, no, you don't times it. You don't times it. Plus 6.77. Plus, what am I plusing so loud for? <laughs> what, what am I laughing for? 1.42 plus, well, you can't really plus the zero, but I'm just going to, I'm just going to plus the zero anyway. <laughs> plus zero. <laughs> plus, oh, no, no, minus no, nope, that's a divide. Minus 3.5. Had you invested in these five coins over the week, and we're only talking three weeks, 
which is <laughs> which is mad when you think of it like that. You, <laughs> is that right? You would have made six point two nine. Is that right? Was the last one a minus? It was minus three point five. I'm just looking, guys. I'm just looking because, well, that's what it says. That's what it says. I feel like I want to put the, these ones and make them a, a, a uh, 0 0.06. I'm just going to do it anyway because, again, you can't really say you made 1 point something percent. Well, I, I suppose you can. Yeah, I suppose you can. 1 point something. 1 times. Yeah, because when you times your thing by 1.4. Yeah, yeah, I suppose it would be the same thing then, isn't it, really? Because I'm looking at this and I'm thinking, well, that should take that should come off the free off the six point seven at least, and then you're t adding the one point. You know what? I'm just gonna be real because when you times something by one, and I've got to keep it real. If you times one pi, but one one times three is three, so you can't say one point three something times three. It's gonna be zero point three, isn't it? I'm just gonna do it anyway. This says six point because I was ex expecting you know at least to come down to three or something. I'm just gonna do it again because I wanted to be real. So. <laughs> 0 0.6 because you how can you tie something but one times two is two <laughs> okay plus six I think I'll get a better reading this way guys trust me seven seven plus zero point four two times your gain right because that's basically what it is you can't times your thing, thing by one because if you had 10 pounds in times of one you still got 10 pounds so you need to just do the 10 pounds by the point zero four you, you don't know what I mean plus <laughs> Okay, just uh, okay. It's looking, it's looking better now. Uh, plus the zero, <laughs> plus uh, minus no minus three point five. That for me looks more realistic. Had you invested, I feel like I'm shouting at you. <laughs> Had you invested in the last five coins that I had shown you, you overall, that's including like the pumps and then some of them coming down, you would have made four point two nine times your profit which means in a sense if you had a thousand pounds and you times your thousand by 4.29 you would have taken your thousand pounds over the last three weeks because that's what we're talking three weeks and you would have turned it into four thousand two hundred and ninety pounds that's just a thousand pounds if you had had a ten thousand pounds you could essentially have times that by ten and you would have made forty two thousand pounds in three weeks some people have that. Some people just have a thousand pounds. So you know, let's divide. <laughs> let's divide it by ten again. Because some people may have just had a thousand pounds. That's still, but that's still nice. I was gonna say that's still bad. <laughs> I was gonna go. That's not bad. That that's still nice. Like I said, in a month, because you're talking three weeks, right? Is that when I made the last video? Let me check. Where is, where is this thing? Here you go. Look here. Three weeks. Four three thousand profit. Three thousand two hundred and ninety pounds profit is not bad. So even if you did invest in them and then you did get a horrible drop in your, your goose finance, Harmony absolutely made up for it. And then, yeah, you would have still made £3,000 on profit. I'm going to leave it here. <laughs> I just wanted to show you this. And I think I'm going to keep doing this when I keep doing these videos because I think it's interesting. I never did it on the last one. You know, I've only just thought, uh, thought now to do it. And I'm going to do it on the next one. If this was helpful to you, Please drop that like. Give me a subscribe if you're new watching. Because you know what? £3,000, you can do a lot with that. You can now invest it into other coins like Enka. Eh, Enka! <laughs> or Ecomi. You can invest, or you can go out and treat yourself. Get yourself some nice shoes, you know. You can do all sorts of that £3,000. Like I said, <laughs> people work full time to make £1,000 after tax. And you just got that chilling from a nice quick three week investment bit of silence there <laughs> i need to do a special shout out to my patrons my god the list is growing and i swear to god i'm gonna be sitting here for about three weeks one day <laughs> because, <laughs> because okay it's too much uh because it's just getting too long shout out to actually i'm just gonna sort of come onto my screen here as well so i can sort of like pan down yeah <clears throat> now my days you ready for this new names i'm gonna have to learn the names Shout out to Daniel Atkins, Tony Matui, Glenda, 
It's time. Cora Black, SM, I Dry, Tassimo He, Tony Dan, Marco Costanti, Jazz, Azari, Michael, AJ, Frank C623, Clarence Dennison, Honcho the First, Christopher Johnson, Jacob Adams, Mr. Anonymous, Captain Goodsmoke, Surad Shuckler, Lewis Roach, Latasha F, Axel, Carlos Rocha, Mr. Tuffu, Damaris, Naj Bogan, Dan Cox, Rahul the God, Dante Kennedy, RG, Brittany Bizzle, Rafael Kakinski. <coughs> that is a name, by the way. <laughs> I'm joking. Max, what am I laughing for? Kenneth Whitley, Wisem, Marcelo Trevino, I think it's Marcelo, you know, Reedy Ux Robinson, Manche Manny Sanchez, <clears throat> my throat, this is what happens when you talk too much, Catherine Cheong, Tyrone Samuel, Stephen Edward, Luca Reno, Abiola, Rachel Mack, Dwayne Suda, Evan Fong, Bola, Pamela Williams, Brandon, Stacks and Racks, Stan Kyle, Rick, Joffrey Williamson, Eric Eubank, Omar Thomas, Casper Neal, Aaron Davis, Damian Hunter. <clears throat> I'm supposed to be panning down <laughs> on the screen. <laughs> You're just sitting. Anyway, because uh, it looks nicer when I'm talking, right? Where was that? Damian Hunter, Rion Wade, Restored by Life, Ali Jill, CCP269, Good Feels Nice. Trust me on that one. Aaron White, Lucas. But it's Lucas. Albert Lynn, Aaron B, Four on a Man, Dominique. <clears throat> my God, my throat. Alex, Alexander Mangian, Will W, Peter Stoddart, Belinda Spencer, Eric Foreman, Semyon, Fatima Price, Shawanda Owens, Trey, Paul Parminder, Tana McLaren, Josh Wills, Ashley Lee, so many of you, where are you coming from? <laughs> Tom Baird, I want to say Baird, like Bard, Baird, because it's B-A-I-R-D, Marcel S. Osk, JF1905, Kevin Ward, Sazavi, Michael Keel, Christopher Hoss, Radiana Mativa, Marcos Jenk, Chris Steed, Peter Mosa, Chris C, Andy Helmuth, Ye Yoke Shek, D Swearing, Ephraim Beraki, Beraki, oh my god, I gotta remember that, <clears throat> remember that surname, Andrea Hardin, Posey Woe, Eric, T Moore, M Clarson, Gerard Miller, Kelvin, I'm still going, <laughs> Badder Than Bald, Giovanni Mendez, William Fox, S Jar, Claudette, Homiliosa, because it sounds like Wingardium Leviosa, <clears throat> Trust me, your surname will be a wicked potion spell. <laughs> Shams Jan, Shakir Hussian, Jeff Tomtich. I think I said that right. New names now. Ricardo Hernandez, JB, Paul Lamarex, Limara Lee Seeley. I think I said that right. Cody Harris and Melissa. I want to say Melissa, but it's got a Z. Melissa, thank you so, so, so much for becoming a Patreon. And all the... <coughs> get my words out <coughs> i'm not cutting it either and all the new patrons i see you all the extra ones thank you so so much i appreciate you all guys they're becoming patrons because they you know they can see so many posts exclusive contents i show what i'm buying when i'm selling what co uh, what coins i'm buying uh what prices i'm selling at when i plan to sell them and how much i'm planning to sell all these things that people want to know you can see that too if you want to become a patron i have seven tiers take your pick i would recommend going for the tier which shows my buy sell stake alerts it's down here somewhere but again it's up to you to choose whichever one you want to go for uh but you can pick your tier and yes thank you all for watching really appreciate you all and i look forward to seeing you in my next video cheers